Welcome to the State Park for this afternoon's match between Stranraer and Forth Athletic. It's essentially two game, of course, and uh, as usual, the highlights package is sponsored by JT Mortgages. Uh, Stranraer uh, line up with three changes from the team that lost to Darvall last week. In goal number 27, Luke Scullion. Number two, Scott Robertson returns. Three, Sean Burns. Five, Ayrton Sonka. Fifteen, Craig Ross. Six, Anton Brady. Eight, Grant Gallagher. Fourteen, Josh Walker. 7 Tommy Muir, 10 Brock Watson and 20 Matty Yates. And we have a full subs bench which you can see on the screen. Four for Mark McCallum is in goal, number 2 Ross Meakin, number 3 Luke Strachan, 4 Stephen Anderson, 19 Andy Munro, 10 Craig Slater, 16 Jamie Ness, 18 Scott Shepherd, 7 Craig Thompson, 17 Stephen McCluskey and 9 Matthew Aiken. Again a full bench for four for Athletic. Uh, former Stranraer player Grant Anderson being the possibly notable name at number 11. Number 23 to note is this uh, for, for manager Gary Urban. And the referee this afternoon refereeing his third match uh, for Stranraer this season, including the away match against for, for earlier in the season, is Mr Scott Lambie. <laughs> the park a long clearance from McCallum Ross doesn't quite get there but doesn't get a second attempt he's left stranded blasted well wide fortunately that's a play for a throw in still trying to find out who the mystery number 8 is Yates on the attack for Sonora turns it across goal oh! Tommy Muir inches away from getting a foot on that and here comes Sonra, uh, come for through Matty Aiken. Good ball forward to Shepherd. Shepherd heading for the penalty box, has to turn back. Finds Craig Thompson, great block by Scullion. Burns goes for a goal, oh, that's the bar! Tremendous effort from, from Grant Gallagher. Usually a preserve of Josh Walker hitting the crosswalk, hitting the woodwork, but from fully 30 yards, Gallagher, tremendous effort. Back off the bar and we're not able to cash in. Gets the ball back from Slater. High one into the box. Nodded down, but nodded past. Trying to split the two central defenders. A good touch there from Aiken. Finds Shepard. Cuts it back, looking for Aiken, and he's found him. Dangerous move. Halted, gets across, but great challenge there by Craig Ross. Silly and well, down well to save there from Slater. Looks to take it down, but doesn't. Now it falls for Walker. Can't quite keep it, but Tommy Muir picks it up. Oh, I was looking for what Tommy have a shot. Matty Yates will have a shot. He's not shy, but uh, wasn't. It was well directed, but didn't have much power behind it, and it's easy enough for McCall. Songs gets his head on it. It's headed back in. Burns goes up for it. Not cleared yet, but it's turned over the ball now. And McCluskey well stopped by. A combination of Burns and Walker and to Tommy Muir. Tommy Muir, good ball this time, finds Matty Yates. Matty cuts inside his man. Goes for a shot, deflected over. That's far, far better. Far, far better from Sonra. Muir and Yates blinking up well. Brilliant cut inside by Yates. And very unlucky to see his shot deflected. It's a long ball towards where Matty Yates wasn't, but Josh Walker is. He sets it off for Matty. Back to Josh. Can't quite control it, he gets it to Matty again. Cuts inside his man, can he get it through? Tommy Muir nips in and intercepts, can't get it back. Walker to Yates. Walker, cut off. Oh, good turn by Aiken. Decides to drive it, good save by Scullion. 
into Shepherd again. Aiken to Shepherd. He's got an awful lot of space there. Nearly good challenge from Burns. Back to Shepherd, who's all his own. Thompson has a chance and drives it. It's blocked. Walker gets it clear, but it's McCluskey driving into the box. Gets it wide, ball across, far post. Burns is the only one who's there. Scullion's coming racing out and makes it. Leaves it to Brady. <laughs> this is Gallus stuff. Brady racing forward. Good ball wide. Trying to find Tommy Muir. Finds Matty Yates instead. Yates turns it back. It's ticked out to Strachan. Strachan down the line, only as far as Ross. Gallagher. Walker. Turns his man. Finds Watson. Back to Walker. Walker. Good work. Brilliant stuff for Walker. Yes! And it's Tommy Muir. Tommy Muir with the opening goal for St. Rob. Brilliant work by Josh Walker. The two players introduced to the team this afternoon have provided the opening goal for St. Rob with 40 minutes on the clock. It's 1-0 St. Rob, the scorer, Tommy Muir. Goal scorer for St. Rob, Tommy Muir. Jamie's still organising down there. He's not happy. Leaking with a long throw. Again. It's still in the box. Oh, it needs to be dealt with. It's not dealt with. Oh, terrible effort from Slater. Looks as if he's... Has he pointed to the spot? Uh, Robbo booked for a late challenge. Well... That is really disappointing. We, admit we did, really didn't deal with that throw into the box. Uh, bounced around, and Robo's been booked for a late challenge. Oh, just beat Scully in the back of the net. Goal scorer for Fafa, number nine, Matthew Aiken. That is so frustrating. You get in front with an excellent goal and then just careless defending gives it away. And we, we're now looking at one each again. Walker floats at the far post this time. Heads go up. Turn, bouncing into the box and McCallum grabs it and sends it out to Mekin as the referee says that'll do us half time. The half-time score, Stranraer 1, for for Athletic 1. Half-time score, but still disappointing to have taken the lead and then throw it away so cheaply. Ball in the box, not properly defended, but the header comes in, but Scullion has no difficulty with that. Brady drives it low. Head to handball, surely. Gallagher. Wriggles his way through. Great drive. Oh, McCallum does well to save that. Good shot from Watson. The third lights have been on since before the match started. Well, the far post, McCallum fumbles it. But uh, the referee says it went by. He tipped it behind for a corner. Walker, watch out behind you. Walker trying to slip one through to Matty Yates. Didn't quite come off. A wide open space is there. This is Thompson's recovered from that earlier knock. Raging into the box, sidesteps and scores. Too much free freedom of the park there down the right. And it's Craig Thompson, number seven, who has given four for the lead after 12 minutes of the second half. Ball throw down the line, so because his head to it, but it's only on field towards Shepherd. McCluskey tries a drive. But high, wide, and not so handsome. To Brady, good ball for Ross in the overlap, but well, it's just a little bit tight. Uh, off the ball incident there. Bracken, Ross, good play from Gallagher to Brady. 
out to Watson. Watson across. Oh, got jammed between Muir and uh, Anderson and Phil. Brady goes into the box. I'm not going to try a short corner or short free kick. Walker chips it in under the bar. That's a goal! He's been, he's been going to get that right for ages. And it's a great goal from Josh Walker. And thoroughly deserved on the run of play. <laughs> goal scorer for Sinra. Josh Walker. Well, given the number of times Walker has hit Woodwork this season from free kicks, seems to have a duty to score one. Uh, hasn't scored one since he put one into the net in the League Cup match against Kilmarnock earlier this season. Okay. Walker goes to challenge. Space for crossing. Gets it out wide, space also back into the box, it's behind everybody. A little bit of a panic there, but we get it away. Josh Walker and Matty Yates, and he's still attacking. Songs and Brady keeping an eye on him. It's back to McCluskey. McCluskey's blocked by Walker. Uh, Sidesteps Brady rather neatly across the goal line. And, well, Scullion's foot does it. That's a great header from Craig Ross to get that ball away. Oh, like th three balls cut out, but well taken by Walker, it turns his man, drives it across the face of the goal, no takers. Really putting Skelly off into the half it goes. Anderson wins it, Robo sends it forward, good ball looking for Woods, Woods takes his man on, look for the box, turns inside his man. Good one-two with Walker, drives it low across, and that's good play again from Sonra, the third corner. Walker back to Ross, good ball inside to Woods, he gets away from his man, finds Smith, Smith and Burns, Burns drives it, oh great save by McCluskey, he can't hold it though. That's a ball out wide for Meekin, Tommy Muir closes him down, but he gets it away and gets it back. Good ball forward to Slater, took up found space there, gets the ball across. Oh, what a save by Scullion. Absolutely brilliant. Well, if we get a point out of this game, that will be one of the memorable moments of the match. An absolutely fantastic save from Luke Scullion. Interesting thing to do, changing a, a team a, a corner. I went to the far post, but it's too high for everybody. It should be too high for everybody. Scullion's up there and he's fouled, surely. No, the referee's allowing play to go on. He did well to keep that out because it looked as if he was fouled. It's back to, to Crossan. Crossan gets it wide and the ball comes in again. Dummied and cleared, not cleared. Spectacular, but over. And a goal kick. Well, hopefully get a breakaway. Josh Walker on the edge of the box. Ball to the far post again. In on the crossbar. The referee, I think, the referee has given it. That's, again, a corner kick to the far post that's undone us. Goal scorer for four for Jimmy Ness. High to the heart, far post, headed back across. Oh, Woods had the shot. Smith picks it up, turns his man, down the line for Woods, driven across, McCallum gets a fist out and knocks it away, Smith picks it up again, he'll send it back in, and McCallum comes racing out, Lang and sizing up the options, it's a decent ball as well, McCallum's coming for it and takes it cleanly. the referee blows for full time That's so disappointing so much into the game and nothing out of it it seems to have been the story of the season but uh, nobody to ask for comments all I can say is uh, another disappointing result not a disappointing performance but a disappointing result
Final scores to involve two, four for Athletic, three.